everybody welcome to engineering academy and in this video i'll be talking about how to design a single reinforced beam all right so we have already looked out a theoretical portion that is required for the design of single reinforced beam and if you haven't watched this video uh, there is a link in the description below go to that uh, link and watch that video and if you already know the theory and just carry on with me all right so here uh, the question says that uh, design a rectangular beam to resist pm of 100 kilometer meter take m20 grade of concrete and fe 500 steel so what do we understand from this question so we understand that the bending moment due to the external load is 100 kilonewton meter and characteristic strength of the concrete is 20 newton per meter square and the yield stress of the or the yield strength of the steel is 500 newton per meter square Alright, so given is that BM bending moment due to the external load is 100 kilonewton meter and factored bending moment we calculate why because limited state of measure says that we have to apply parcels factor of safety to the load and the parcel factor of safety for the load is 1.5 here. Alright, so 1.5 times 100 that is 150 kilonewton meter and if we change the unit to newton uh, mm we get as 115 to 10 to the 6 all right so now for we know that for fe 500 grade of steel we have limiting moment of resistance that is m limb is 0 0.133 fck bd square right so we have already uh, seen this formula in the theoretical portion okay so m limb here we got 115 to 10 to the power 6 and is equal to 10.133 fck is 20 and b and d we don't know yet all right so bd square we get this value this long value all right so now let us take b is equal to 2 by 3 times of d uh, let me tell you that we can vary b from 1 by 2 to 2 by 3 times of the d so that is the thumb rule all right so uh, so d is nearly equal to small d so d is the overall depth of the beam and d is the effective depth of the beam all right so they are nearly equal okay so we get that b is equal to d by 1.5 and if we put the value of b in this equation then we'll get the value of d as 438.97 mm so adopt d is equal to 500 mm so that capital d we adopt as 500 mm thus d is equal to d minus effective cover that is 500 minus effective cover and we get small d as 465 mm all right so then b comes as 2 by 3 times of the capital d that is equal to 500 uh, so 500 mm that is capital d and we get the value of b as 333.33 so we add up b as 300 mm the section of the beam is b times of d so always represent the section of the beam as b so breadth times of the depth so first come the breadth and then comes the depth all right so we get b as 300 and capital d as 500 mm all right so now we calculate the area of steel that is required for this section so we know that moment of resistance with respect to the steel is 0.87 fi times of ast d minus fi times of ast by fck into b and if we put the respective values we get 150 into 10 to the power 6 0.87 fi is 500 then we you know we don't know the ast yet and it's 465 minus 500 times of ast by 20 into 300 all right so we can calculate this value as soon so this is how you solve this uh, equation you just press 150 then we got into 10 to the power 6 right so it's exponent 6 then we press alpha then we press is equal to then 0 0.87 so all you have to do is that uh, just put that equation into your calculator and we press 500 and into so ast that is unknown so we press alpha times of x that is our variable and then we say 465 and we press minus then we press the fraction and 500 into alpha x divided by 20 into 300 right so we close the bracket and after that we press shift and we press calc and we press is equal to so we get the value of 880.50 so this is how you calculate these type of equations all right solving we get ast as 880.50 mm square 
so now the minimum area of steel that is required so this value is as per IS 46 2000 so it says that minimum area of steel in beam is 0.85 times B times of D by FY so 0.85 times of 300 into 500 by 500 all right so we get at 255 mm square so minimum area of steel is 255 mm square and the area of steel that we have provided is 80.50 as per our calculation so we are fine with it thus we provide 220 mm and 216 mm bars to give the total area of 1030 mm square alright this is the final section of the beam so our depth is 500 mm and breadth is 300 mm so 220 mm diameter bars are at the edge and 260 mm diameter bars are inside alright so this is how you calculate the value alright so this is how you solve the, this type of numerical equations